Welcome back everyone. We're going to be doing another video. You might be in a position where for some reason you cannot access the desktop website on any website you're in, whether that's in Safari or Chrome. Now, this will probably only work if you're in Safari, but it'll also work in other ways and other methods, and I'll show you in Chrome as well. Now, there's two different ways to go about doing it. If you're on iOS 13, then this way will work, but if you're on iOS 12, there's actually a way easier method that you don't necessarily have to go this way about going about doing it. So first of all, if you're on iOS 13, which I'll show you right now, you wanna load up any website. So right now I have my own channel loaded, but if you're trying to load up a Reddit website or whatever the case is, it will probably end up working in the same exact way. Now, like I said before, there's two different ways to go about doing it. So within iOS 13, if you look in the top left corner, you see the little two A's right next to the URL. If you actually go ahead and click that, you'll get presented a bunch of different options. Now, one of them is request desktop website, and that's exactly how you request the desktop website. Now, I'll go ahead and click it. There's a way that it will work. Now, there's a way that it might work as well. YouTube is one of those weird sites that it might not work. So I'll go ahead and tap on it. Now, well, hopefully it will go through, and as you can see, it did go through, which is perfectly fine. Now, let's say for some reason it didn't go through. Most websites that are on Safari or whatever, they usually have a desktop access on their own website, which if you click, it might work, it might not work. In this case, if we click those top three dots, you can see that we have a desktop website option. So if that method did not work, which it should, you can always go this route as well and request a desktop site that way. And as you can see, you're in that as well. Now, if you're on iOS 12 or below, so if you're on iOS 11 or iOS 12, if you have an iPhone 6 or whatever, the method is kind of the same, but it's a little bit different. So instead of clicking the top two little double A right there or clicking the top three dots in the top right corner, what you can actually do is click the share button that's right here. And then you'll eventually get presented into this little website or this little shopping, whatever this is. And what you can do is scroll down until you find the request desktop website here, or request desktop, or whatever tag. Now, once you click that, it'll get you to the same exact page it was before. And I'll show you on the screen right now of basically what that specific little icon looks like. But it looks exactly like what I showed you guys before. And then at that point, you're pretty much coming back to here. And that's honestly pretty much the way to do it. It's super easy. It does not take that much time. But just really just depends on which version of software you're on. If you're on iOS 13, then obviously the first method will work. If you're on iOS 12, the other method will work. So that's really pretty much it. If you guys have any other questions or any other problems, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would mean so much. But definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count. So it means so much if you guys could hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my main channel. All those links are linked down below. I'd really appreciate it if you guys could check it out. More importantly than everything, I also love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.